Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I've done a vlog. I've literally just uploaded workout videos for the past, what, two weeks? Just because I've just felt like I've had nothing to show. And I have been really busy to be fair. I've been working during the weeks, doing Vixen, doing just everything. And then on the weekends I've been doing my commissions like her and some other nudes and prints and just different things like that. So it's been really busy. So it's been quite hard to... I don't know, put a vlog in and I just feel like it'll be so boring me just vlogging me on the laptop or me doing art but to be fair that is kind of what I'm going to do today because <laughs> I just felt like it had been so long I should at least record something, have a little catch up, say hi and just, I don't know, just show you guys a bit of my day because yeah I don't want to just post one workout video a, day, uh, a week sorry so yes I'm doing this vlog. Now it is Saturday so this will hopefully go up tomorrow, Sunday, which obviously when you're watching this will be today or it could be the month of the past or whenever you watch it. Um, I woke up at quarter to five this morning, really needed the toilet and I just could not get back to sleep after that. I just, oh so yeah, it's like 10 o'clock now and I've already... I feel like I've already done quite a lot. Like maybe I should start waking up at six every morning, but I just don't think I could bring myself to do that. So I've been editing my podcast today. So I've mentioned in a, my last vlog, whenever it was, that me and my brother and sister started like a true crime comedy podcast. We had some technical difficulties. I have started uploading them on a Friday, but we had technical difficulties this week. So I'm only just getting to edit it now. So hopefully that'll be up tomorrow when this YouTube video is up on Sunday. Um... So that's what I have to do today. I need to edit the podcast. I need to do commissions. I've got a couple canvas commissions, a couple painting commissions. Um, I don't think I've got any macrame to do. I have some pots, some clay pots to paint. I have to do my isolation coats and varnishes for some of the commissions I've already done. Um, I need to edit this YouTube video and put this up. So I do have a lot of random stuff to do, but it is such a beautiful day today. This week, the sun has just hit. It has been so nice. It's just, yeah, oh my gosh, as soon as the sun comes out, you just want to be out and it feels good. And especially living in Brighton, I just want to be down on that beach with a side art and just loving life. And I kind of want to take my skateboard down and just practice some tricks. So me and Tyler might do that when he comes back from work. He's just at work at the moment. But yeah, we'll see what happens. I don't know what I'm going to be able to fit in. I don't know what I'm going to be able to record for you guys, but that is that. Something really exciting this week though is obviously Boris's announcement for the UK that we are, sorry, I keep touching my hair. It's because I washed it, so it's wet and it's just annoying me a bit. Um, we have some timeline now of when things are going to open, when shops are going to open, hopefully, when I'll be able to see my family and friends again, which I'm just so, so, so excited about. So yeah, I literally just, oh, this week's just been so full of life and motivation because of that announcement and because the sun's been out, so it's just been such a good week. Um, oh, I can show you some of my bits I got from Oliver Bonus. So I got some new homestyle bits. My friend got me a gift card, so I got some bits. I am literally obsessed with home decor. Like, I love, obviously, I'll just paint loads of stuff and put it up on the walls, but I love like all my plants and my little ornaments and candles and this is my first apartment I've ever had so I'm just getting so keen over home decor so I got a few bits from Oliver Bonus so literally just a couple bits one is this beautiful watering can how gorgeous is that I mean it is such a ornament in itself as well as the fact that it's purposeful and I can water my plants normally I have to fill up a jug and water them and refill so this I actually really need this because obviously I've got like, all these plants in the living room and I just think it's so beautiful it's got this little green handle and an engraving of plants and it's just it's beautiful I love it it was like 30 pounds then these tiny these are so much smaller than I thought they were going to be so I'm kind of deciding whether to keep them or not even though they're just so pretty but I thought they were going to be a lot bigger it is pretty cute, isn't it? Little bird salt and pepper shaker. And there's just two of them. I mean, they are cute and I just love the colours. But they're tiny. So I don't know if I'm going to keep it. It was like £15. So I don't know. Um, and then, last thing I got was these beautiful gin glasses. And I realised... 
I saw them and I just thought, oh my gosh, they're beautiful. Also, me and Tyler did a virtual cocktail making class last Friday, which was so much fun. After the class finished, we just carried on drinking, making cocktails and put music on and we just had such a good night. I really recommend people to do it because you get so comfortable just being at home. Like me and Tyler, obviously, we're just so comfortable here and he'll get home from work and on the weekend we'll just chill, put a film on and doing something like that. We just had so much fun together. We put the music on the speaker and we just had such a good night. It was just so much fun. So yeah, I recommend people just get a bit drunk, have a bit of fun. So look, these are my gin glasses. But yeah, we had wine glasses, but nothing for anything else. I don't know if that's focused in on it. But honestly, it is so beautiful and it's pink and it's got a gold rim and I just love them. And it's a set of four and that they were £26. But I love them so much. I will link it below if you guys are interested in them. I think Oliver Bonus is so beautiful. I mean, I'm a very colourful person. I just love colours and designs and all sorts. So Oliver Bonus is just a bit of me because they do the most beautiful little quirky items. I just love them. Um, do I have anything else to say to you? I don't know. Um, if you guys haven't checked out my podcast, I would love it if you check it out. I've put the link below. We're on episode four now. Well, five is hopefully going to go up tomorrow. And we're just having so much fun with it. We're kind of trying to decide whether to keep it a bit more light, light-hearted stories so we can make more jokes and have a bit more banter. Or if people do like proper true crime murder stories. Like, I know obviously people love true crime stories, but do you want us to do that? Like, if you listen to the podcast, I would just love your feedback and let me know if what you prefer when we tell more light-hearted and make more jokes or you think we can mix it up and do some darker stories as well. Because my brother doesn't like true crime, that's the thing, and he's obviously in the podcast, so he really struggles with some of the stories when they're, like, really depressing and sad. So I don't know. Let us know your opinions. Um, let me show you my clay pots I did yesterday so i bought this air drying clay and i'm trying to learn how to make like pots and ring dishes and things like that and it's so much fun i recommend people to get it it's like three pound for the clay and it's just a really fun thing to do especially when you're in lockdown so so these are ones i've made before so you can tell these are just kind of practice ones like they're not they are very um they're very natural as you can see it's not perfect at all it's a bit <laughs> jumbled but I was just practicing different designs my Dalmatian ones like a little incense I mean that was easy and cute to make this I was practicing using gold foil and that's like a little tea light I mean you can see how uh, kind of rubbish it is <laughs> I mean look these are all my hand prints because I my fingerprints because I didn't understand how to smooth it out but obviously with practice you get better and this one kind of cracked in the oven when I dried it but I have more in the oven now, so I'm actually just going to go and have a look and show you guys those. And those ones are better, like I am getting better at it, so I'll show you. So you can see here, these ones are much better shaped. Like this one here, you can see I've done a much better job of shaping that one. The lighting's not amazing in here, so it was probably going to be easier for me to just show you those later if I managed to have time to paint them. The house also is such a mess and I really need to clean it, so that's another thing on my list of to-dos. I'm gonna go back into the living room. So I'm just gonna get cracking really on with my day and I'll just have the camera up recording what I get up to basically. So I've just got my paint clothes on because I'm gonna do my isolation coats of the commission pieces I've already finished. The isolation coat just goes on before the varnish and I need to dust it all to make sure no hairs and dust get stuck in the isolation coat. And then I can varnish it in a couple days and then after all that's done, I can send it off to its owner. <music> I was going to start on some commissions, but the podcasts I really need to get done urgently and there's a lot of it. So I'm going to start just doing some of the podcasts now and try and get some of it done. So I'm not literally spending hours and hours and hours tonight. So I'm going to try to break it up a bit. So time for some editing. <laughs> So it is half one and I'm stopping for a break because I'm starving. I'm having my bagel. This is 
chicken slices because it's easy, tomato, cucumber, may light mayo and avocado and it's literally incredible, it's so beautiful. I'm also having a packet of Quavers because I love Quavers at the weekend and milk. That is my school pack lunch lunch and I'm gonna probably watch friends while I do that. Tyler's just got home and he wants us to go down to the beach in a bit so I'm gonna see what happens. So me and Tyler have gone out because it is a beautiful sunny day. Obviously it's not warm warm but it is nice and sunny. So we're gonna go down to the beach. Just have a bit of a chill there really. I've got my skateboard. So if I wanna do any tricks I can. And just enjoy the sand. Got my spritzer. Sunny day. What are you up to? Oh god, no, no. <laughs> shy? So shy. Me and Tyler are chilling. Got my spritzer. Love and life. gonna read my book and just chill in the sun it is so busy today you enjoyed yourself Tyler you can talk you can say you enjoyed yourself well done you spoke. <laughs> there's so many people on paddle boards. <laughs> it is so amazing. I really want to get a stand up paddle board, an inflatable one, so you can just bring it down and pump it up. But I just looked and they're like 300 pounds. I did not know that, so something to save for the summer. Are you going to buy it for me? As well as my bike. A stand up paddle board, and you want to buy how much is your bike? 800 pounds. Best start saving. So we've just got home and it is 22 6 and we're gonna have a quick spruce up just tidy everything because it's a mess and then i'll probably just do something creative but chill hat head you're a hat head yeah, we moved this room around it's a proper mess but we put the table there so oh. when you walk in it's just open. I just think it looks so much nicer. Like how much nicer does that look? It's just so much more spacious. We literally just have stuff everywhere. All my canvases and art, oh, art everywhere, everywhere. So pretty much just finished cleaning. Let me show you the beautiful room. Oh, well, that needs to get returned. That is my canvases. They just have to stay for the time being. They will go behind there when I've finished with my art project over here. Okay, so that makes it still look messy, but it's cause I'm gonna still be doing stuff with this. So this has to stay out. But otherwise, doo -doo -doo. I love this corner now. I'm just so excited. It's such a pretty little corner. I had to buy a new ivy because my other one just fully died. So this one's all fresh. And these are my beautiful dried flowers that Tyler got me for Valentine's Day. I love them so much. Look at them in the mirror. So pretty. Beautiful kitchen. You did a very good job here. Oh, Tyler. Take me past me, baby. 
Is this the cake you got? Of all cakes, what is this? It's just some dead sponge. Why did you get that? That's nice. A bit plain, it's isn't it? Sponge. Sponge and it's like primary school, isn't it? Mm. Mm, see, I'm a master at work. I'm gonna get on with my own shebang. I don't know what to do. Like, I really can't bother to get the paints out and start doing painty stuff. I might just draw the commissions I need to do. Look, I could live at milk in my beautiful new gin mug. And also my clay has come out the oven now. So as you can see, I mean, this one's still a bit not the best. You can see the marks. But when I paint it, it'll still look nice, I think. This one came, broke a bit, which is a bit annoying. But these ones, let me get out of this line. These ones I'm pretty happy with. I mean, that's got a little bit of a thing there and there. I mean, that's got a mark, but once I paint over it. But I'm happy with those. It's looking a lot better, my little clay section. So I was gonna paint them, but yeah, I cannot be able to get paints out now. So what I'm thinking is I might start drawing some of the commissions that I'm gonna do, and then I can paint those tomorrow. So yeah, I'm gonna start with that and see how I get on. This is the start of my fairy that I'm doing for a child's bedroom and I'm going to paint it all multicoloured. I have to stop there because I've just realised the time and the fact that I need to edit this YouTube video and get it uploaded tonight so that it's ready to post tomorrow. And I also still need to edit like another two hours of the podcast. So yeah, no more drawing for tonight. And I'm going to say goodbye. So thank you guys so much for watching. I know this probably wasn't very interesting, but I just thought it would be good to get something up. Let me know if there is anything you would want me to see on my vlogs or I don't know, just anything you're interested in. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you liked it. Please give it a thumbs up if you like the video. And I will hopefully see you next week. Thank you. Bye.